Hello and a very warm welcome to today's um, video. My name is Ozair and today I've got a very special guest. His name is uh, Dennis Yu from Blitzmetric. Hello Dennis, how are you? Hey Ozair, how are you doing? I'm very well, thank you. Thank you so much for joining in and um, sharing your um, knowledge, expertise on video marketing. Who would have so, thought the search engine engineer is the guy who's going to talk about video? <laughs> so before we get started, Dennis, um, what I would like you to do is to just to introduce, give a brief introduction to everyone who you are, what you do, if they haven't, uh, I'm sure most many have heard of you and know of you. I'm a former search engine engineer. I built the analytics at Yahoo 20 years ago. And my partner and I, Perry Marshall, had the number one best-selling book in social media on Amazon. And it's on TikTok ads, the definitive guide to TikTok ads, which is about short form video. And the last five or six years, we have made so many little videos, cell phone videos. And we've been helping agencies do this. We've done several seven figure agencies. And there's this huge wave that's creating jobs all over the planet of people that are making little 15 second videos in every single area of digital marketing. And I find it absolutely incredible. Literally here, this iPhone is a money-making device. This has put so many businesses, so many videographers, whatever, out of business because of how you can just make these videos. And I've been on a mission. I've personally made tens of thousands of videos here. And we, you'll see, depending on when you're listening to this podcast, the videos that Jake Paul and I made together last year to teach a bunch of young adults how to do video. A lot of business owners were teaching how to do 15 second videos like chiropractors and real estate agents. We have scripts for everything, certifications. You already know about digital marketer. Yeah. So we've been teaching the one minute video, teaching dollar a day. Yeah. But I'm on a mission to create a million jobs and that comes through yeah. education and certification. Well, that's a, 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 a massive goal to create so many jobs. So I'm going to go, touch on that in a minute, but I think we got a few things I would like to go through and I'm sure our viewers would be interested to learn as well. So I personally have followed you for quite a while, learned a lot from you, respect what you do tremendously and started my video marketing journey just by listening to you. Uh, I initially came across you via Digital Marketeer and just creating these little videos. And now we upload a video a day for the last four, four years and do live streams as well. Fantastic. And it has changed, yeah, it has changed the way uh, we generate our leads and customers for sure. But many people still are very hesitant and reluctant to start with video, even though, as you said, it's so easy now with a mobile phone and also 15 seconds, 60 second videos you can yeah. create effortlessly. Why do you think that is? What's that mental block or in that mindset? A lot of people don't like how they look. They don't like how they sound. It ties into things like public speaking. So if you can just get over that, look, I don't even have any hair, right? Same here. <laughs> I don't speak yeah. perfectly. I didn't even speak English until I was six. So don't worry about that. The things that people have the mental block over are not the things that your user or your audience cares about. And the other part too, is that it doesn't have to be in perfect production quality. A lot of people think it's gotta be in a studio. You have to hire a video editor. You have to get a fancy camera. You, you don't have to have any of those things. You just need this. You actually do need good sound. That's the thing, good sound is yeah. the Sound but it's very inexpensive. It's a microphone you can clip on. Yeah. 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 Ten dollar microphone sounds great. The key thing with the microphone is it has to be within 12 inches of your mouth. So that's the second thing. And the third thing, which is I think the most shocking, is that you can have other people make your video for you. So this is not really a new this is not a new concept, but it's completely new in the way it's implemented. So you know that people in marketing and, and you know, the world of marketing is driven by referrals and reviews and word of mouth, right? Yelp and Amazon, like it's all reviews, right? But how many of us are still relying upon doing our own marketing for ourselves? 
as in we're coming up with the words, we're coming up with the images and the videos, we're building the landing pages, we're having to do the marketing. We don't do our marketing and of the clients we work with, they don't do their marketing because what they do is they get 15 second videos with their clients, interviewing them on a Zoom call or making a 15 second video when they walk into the office or how they operate a day in the life. This works in every single industry. We've done it with thousands of companies from the smallest little consulting, real estate, home repair, mortgage, all the way up to huge companies. And it's, well, the neat thing is that TikTok, the reason why they're in the lead on advertising now, and they've grown so much, 11 billion in ads in just the last 12 months, mm -hmm. probably going to surpass Facebook soon, is that they, their whole system is built upon our ability to boost someone else's post. So imagine you have a customer or a partner or a creator who's making videos on your behalf, or maybe just they, do, they weren't even making a video for you intentionally, but they were just mentioning you. You can identify that video, go to them saying, hey, I would like to boost your post. They give you the access code. Now I can boost their post, right? Oh, really? Wow. Yeah. So it was there. You know about the dollar day strategy. You know yeah. about you know, yeah. how... Yeah. You can make videos of yourself. You can collect videos, which some people call testimonials, but I don't like testimonials because it, you're collecting stories, right? That are valuable, that are interesting. And you would put them on your public figure page on Facebook. You would put them on your website. You would put them on your YouTube. Yeah. But what if somebody makes a post about you and it's from yeah. their Facebook page, from their Twitter from their TikTok, from their Snapchat. Doesn't that change it? Even if it's the exact same video, isn't yeah. it different if it's from them? Like I'm part of, so, so we know we, we do the face socks, right? And at videosocks.com where we, we ship out people's faces with you know socks with their faces on it, which is a cool gift. And the thing that drives all the sales of that, and same thing for pets, all the sales are driven by UGC, meaning, a partnership like with the Humane Society. And we talk about all this for the Humane Society, if, you know, supporting animals. And so they'll make posts about us boosted, in which we boost from their page, right? Mm -hmm. From their Instagram. So I'd almost want to ask you, Luzair, why do you think it is that people aren't boosting their the, the posts from their best customers and partners and other creators? Wow. I mean, this changes the dynamics completely where you have the option to boost somebody else's uh, video on their channel. Yeah. Oh, I, I, I didn't realize you can do that on TikTok. So and you can, you can do it. You've been able to do it for five years on mm -hmm. Facebook and Instagram through the branded content tool. Yeah. But you have to go through, you know, it's more difficult to do. And a lot of people get confused with business manager, that kind of thing. That's right. Yeah. But going back to that 15 second video, can you just show very quickly what, how you would, what would you say, or how would you create a 15 second video? Just on 15, any topic, if you like. Yeah. 15 second video has three parts to it. First is the hook to get their attention because people are scrolling. So you have to immediately be clear, why should I continue? Why should I pay attention? So usually there's some kind of movement. There's big words right there. A lot of people don't have the big captions, which is like a thumbnail. The second part's the body. So you have to say something interesting, something helpful, something that reveals a problem. So people are like, oh, I have that. That's my pain. I deal with this mm. issue, right? And then the third part's the call to action. Yeah. Schedule an appointment. Come sign up I for know. my webinar. Call me at this phone number, come visit my store, you know, whatever it is, it's a direct call to action. So you have to link these three parts together, but most people, they end up saying, oh, I'm Uzair. I've been doing digital marketing for 20 years. Let me tell you all these other random things that doesn't even matter because when care. people open, when people open with the, oh, I'm Uzair. I've been doing digital marketing for 20 years. They don't care because yeah. you, you, you have an established credibility. So most people make the mistake of saying who they are first and saying who the, what all their products and services are first. Yeah, That doesn't work, right? No. So what we do, let's see if I can, can I share my screen here? Um, yeah. You're in control on this. Uh, you can, just give me one moment. 
Yeah, I can see your screen. Okay. Can you see this? Yeah. So this is my phone on Google Photos, and it's capturing everything on my iPhone so that there's proof, right? Yeah. So let's just say for fun, who's there? Name a city, any city in the world. Chicago. Chicago. Now, Google has categorized all the things that I've been doing in Chicago when I'm in Chicago, so I'm not tagging Chicago. And look, yeah. I was doing 75 hard, so I had to take a picture every day oh, when I was wow. in Chicago. Wow. I was at their Chicago headquarters with Google, right? Yeah. And here I'm in Chicago with Facebook, and we're having meetings, right, on product management, and this is where their whole agency team is based out of, where they work with agencies. And I'm taking a lot of these behind-the-scenes photos and videos of working mm -hmm. out, of eating, my favorite fried chicken place. So these are all stories. I can do a voiceover narration. I can take clips of these and put them together. And mm -hmm. then I could say, let's say for example, my goal was I'm an agency and I wanna be able to do Facebook ads. I wanna bring, let's say sports teams for Facebook ads. Then mm -hmm. I could start with the clip showing us walking through Chicago, you know, at Facebook's headquarters and say, here's what Facebook says about sports teams. You know, Facebook ads for sports teams, or, or that's actually not that great of a title. I'd have to think of some, I, you know, a clever yeah. copywriter. Yeah. And I would overlay that on top of this particular that's thing. Perfect. So this is a, this is a park bench from Wrigley Field, right? Yeah. At the Facebook Chicago headquarters. And I can literally take this, put the words over the top of it and say, Number, the number one tip Facebook has for sports teams, right? And that would be my opening piece. And then in the middle, I would say something like custom audiences get an average of a 20 ROAS. And the way you set it up is by combining your email, web, and I'm trying to think about exactly how I do it because it has to be snappy. And page engagement audiences. Yeah. Come get our guide on how to do remarketing and yeah. capture 15 second videos here, right? Something like that, right? Mm -hmm. so, right. So I'm capturing their attention. I'm saying something interesting and worthwhile. Yeah. And then, or it could maybe the the first first scene is people are afraid of or, or per, performance is falling on Facebook question yeah. mark. Yeah. And then I'll say no, it's not because it's all about in native engagement through lead mm -hmm. ads through video engagement and mm. not as much through sending to websites. Here's yeah. our guide on how to overcome iOS 14 and Chrome issues, right? So yeah. I would just have that cycle through a few different things here. So I could go to Menlo Park where their headquarters is, or I go to yeah. London, right? And I could show all these videos and pictures of me teaching at Facebook, right? Yeah. In Menlo Park. See, there's all these ones here with other agencies yeah. here I'm teaching or eating their food. Yeah. And look, this is, this is ridiculous, but this is one where I'm literally just walking around at their headquarters with, you know, they, they have an ice cream shop, right? Yeah. I have lots of, they have a video game room. They have this upside down Instagram yeah. room. They have a Fox that's on the headquarters. I have so many of these shots hanging out at Facebook, right? Yeah. And I could use combinations of these. L look at this ridiculous thing. So they have this wall that's upside down. So when yeah. you ro rotate it, it looks like you're talking, you know, yeah. looks like you're standing on the wall kind of. Mm -hmm. Where's the thing to rotate this thing? Mm -hmm. Anyway, you, you see the idea, right? Yeah. Yeah. So these photos you can import easily into Canva and create some animation and movement and create a 15 yeah. second video without a video itself. Right, and there's lots of other tools. So yeah. TikTok has in, built inside their ads manager, mm. they have a whole set of video tools. And when you make TikToks, you can you don't need Canva, you don't need Premiere, you don't need Final Cut Pro or any of these wow. different tools. They make it very, very easy. And I think that's why these other tools are getting, yeah. that's why TikTok is, is ma they're making it so easy, easy for people yeah. who don't know how to edit video and don't, I don't want to edit video, I don't know how to edit yeah. video. Yeah. Yet I'm making these short little videos mm. just based on mm. here. Like yeah. literally, like have you seen Descript? I've heard and I've seen briefly, yeah. 
I've heard very good it's, reviews. It's so easy. I'll show you like this. So literally I could do a camera recording and I'll look here and I'll say, Uzair and I are talking about why video is so key to your digital marketing. He's been going live twice a week on Facebook and YouTube teaching about video marketing and how it's key. If you're doing PPC and you're doing Facebook ads and TikTok, you need to come check out what Uzair is doing. He's been doing it for 20 years. We have a new podcast episode talking about how things have changed, especially with TikTok. Come check it out. Okay, so now this is this video. You can see this, right? Yeah. Already yeah, been right. already been transcribed. Mm. And I, you know what I should have done is made some mistakes. I should have made more mistakes, but look, so this pretty good. speaker's me. I can have it detected. Look, look at this. Talking about why video is so key. But I said why video is so key, but maybe I'm going to change it. I'm going to say why PPC is so key. Yeah. Okay. And maybe now instead of you've been doing it for 20 years, maybe I'll just say you've been doing it for 21 years because maybe, you know, it's a year later. And now we need to update this, right? Okay. So this, this is something that the AI is now able to change the words. And I are talking about why PPC is so key to your digital marketing. Wow. Okay. So it's tools like this. You, you can, let's see here. Let's just go down here. Listen to this. Check out what Uzair is doing. He's been doing it for 21 years. <laughs> okay. So we need to make it, we, we can clean it up a little bit. Yeah. We can change we can change the background voice, yeah, yeah, we can change yeah, the yeah. amount of sound, like all of these different things, right? Wow. Yeah. Wow. Amazing. So this, this is what we're talking about now. So imagine you have your best blog post and it was, let's just take a look. So you rank on Google, you rank, let's see, true view discovery ads. Let's see. What are the best practices for creating? How to use a sauna? Oh, look, you moved up onto the first page on how to use a sauna effectively. Interesting. Yeah. How to duplicate Google ad campaigns. Okay. Let's say you have a, you know what? I'm just going to do this. Hmm. This is amazing. Oh, look at the things that you have. Okay. So all you guys out there, look at the best content that you've ever made. And it could be, what, what's your best content? Um, oh God. Um, I mean like this is Kasim. They featured one of the, Oh, Kasim is amazing. Yeah. Yeah. The one hey, with the see. video, the top one, the green oh, one is. One. Yeah, yeah. Well. Oh yeah. Yeah. This is a good headline. The secrets to starting <laughs> this ad. Hang on a second. I hate it. It was pre-roll ads. Notice that actually, and actually, do you see what's, what's going on here in this ad? Yeah. She's using her cell phone. This is one of those driving. Of course, the other guy is the one that's driving. So yeah. they're making things in the car be safe, right? Yeah, right. But this is the kind of video that works because it looks very non-ad-like. But it's an ad, right? Obviously. Yeah. So skip hey, this. this. Awesome solution, and mm -hmm. welcome to your day. There's Kasim and you. Yeah. You've had 3,000 people see this. Mm -hmm. And, oh, so he interviewed you. Okay, awesome. He challenged mm -hmm. himself to shoot a video every day for 90 days. And you go on for half an hour, they link to you and Kasim gets a fair amount of traffic. So that's not yeah. bad. 3000, right? Yeah. And you've inspired other people to make their videos, even for people like you and I that suck at video, right? We're still making the yeah. videos, right? Absolutely. You and I are not Tom Cruise or whoever, right? Not at all. <laughs> okay. Well, so I'm not. <laughs> here's something that all of you guys that are in digital marketing should know how to do is so easy. Okay. So this here. You have the video on YouTube. It's been repurposed here to his site, Solutions yeah. 8. Yeah. But do you see here, this page has zero backlinks. You didn't link to it. He interviewed you. Why don't you link to it? Is there? No, I just came across it recently. So I will. This is featuring you. This is great. Yeah. Maybe yeah. it just, maybe it's a brand new episode, this kind That's of thing. Right, yeah. But what we see all the time is that, so Kasim's is a pro. 
So of course mm. he's going to repurpose his video into a blog post, but a right. lot of the videos that, that we're making, we are not repurposing. So if I say, if I just look at your name, well, if you type in SF digital, because that's where the, the, um, all the videos are, yeah, the yeah, here over here. yeah. Okay. So look, oh, this is a great example. Google ads tutorial 2021. Well, you want to, no one's going to want to click on that compared to Google ads tutorial 2022, right? That's right. So then you would just modify this, but let's say that you don't want to re-record the whole thing. Then you can mm -hmm. just change. You can, I can just pull oh, this video wow. down, right? And turn yeah. and and modify it using the AI that I told you. Yeah. So anytime yeah. you say 2021, we can change yeah. your words to say 2022, right? Wow. Wow. And then this one here. Let's see if we can find this one on your site. Is it on your site? You turn to an article. Um, we we do put a blog post as well on our site. Okay, but this one is apparently hard to find. Yeah. Okay, so this one, and a lot of a lot of people when they just make a blog post based on the video, they screw it up. So what yeah. you want to do? So I have a tool called 4K Video Downloader. I have lots of tools, by the way. And then I'll grab this URL, this video URL. Have you seen this before? You're a video guy. No. Okay, now this is 27 minutes, so it might take a couple minutes longer. Yeah. Oh, no, it'll take two minutes. No, it'll take one minute. Okay, mm -hmm. so I'm pulling down your video right now. Yeah. And then I'm going to pull it in the Descript, transcribe it, and make a blog post based on it, right? Got it. Isn't that really cool? And it's amazing. A lot of you guys think that blogging is some difficult kind of thing. It's actually really easy. So what you do with blogging, I would say, well, here's my, here's my video. Okay. So I could turn that into a blog post. I can continue to add mm. to this. Yeah. And then I could, I could just take this and why does it say Hosea? Yeah. This. It's usually they call me Jose. <laughs> so then I just, I have to come in here and obviously correct yeah. it. So I could have a VA come in here and fix the transcription errors hmm. and then copy this and turn it into a WordPress blog. Right. Yeah. And then I would come to my blog. I'm to, and I would write a blog post just like this. Add new and. on that one got to be careful about what I have copying and pasting who's there Karawala made a video a day for 90 how many days yeah 90 days well now it's four years four years and here's what happened what happened and I'll tell you what's happening now Dennis yeah is if you open up a new tab and search for a keyword like Google Ads, learn Google Ads 2022, yeah. you get multiple videos ranking on Google page one. Mm. So learn Google Ads as a keyword. I think very well. Okay. Google ads 2022. Okay. So learn, learn Google ads. Let's say learn Google ads 2022, because that's the keyword we go after. Learn Google, Google ads, ads 2022. Okay. So then you will see. There you are. The ad is there. So you've got one, two, I think there will be more. Yeah. This one here, you have two of them. Three, four, all four. Oh, wow. Okay. And I think our, read, our blog also gets ranked yeah. at the bottom somewhere. So Google is giving a lot of priority to videos. They're ranking it above even higher than the search results. Yeah. That is clever. Wow. You'll get multiple videos on the first page. Yeah. Most of them are from who's there. Okay. 
Well, all of them. <laughs> yeah, that's right. It's true. All of them. Yeah. All of them are from Uzair. Okay. And then I would in, in, include that image. You ever seen somebody write a blog post on the fly? No. This is How long does it take to make a blog post? Hmm? Yeah, that is absolutely incredible. Yeah. Because now I can make a blog post about how to make a blog post yeah. by Dennis Hugh. And we made mm. a video together using my favorite. Oops. I'm not even a fast typer, but we do it quickly. Yeah. My favorite video AI tool, which, and of course, I would link to all my training on how to use this, which lets you create or lets you edit video as easily as typing. Okay. And then let's see, I'm going to export this video. Of course, I can export it in YouTube. I can export it to with, you know, with captions and all these other things. I do all kinds of crazy, awesome effects, but that's not what we're talking about here. And export. Yeah. Okay. And it was there. Okay, good. I would probably want to name it better than that. Yeah. And then we just pulled down this video of you. Here it is. So now Google ads tutorial. 2021 so let's let's do this new project you never want to put it in my workspace because then no one else can see it it has to be in this mm. drive space people don't get this uh, people mess this up this is like the most common mess up that people okay. do and then look at this i will pull in this video that we just made where is this here let's go look at this one we called it was that i think so the one that we just uh, pulled out of this this one here google, oh, has google has tutorial yeah so this let's look at this if you can hear me and see me okay please put in a little oh we want to get rid of those pieces here so i would clip that mm. but let's see google ads tutorial okay so let's come over here and look at Google Ads tutorial. I we did two videos, the one we downloaded and the one we made together, right? Yeah. There it is. Google Ads tutorial. Okay. So now Oops. I got so many tools open. <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to yeah. There it is. I'm going to drag this into here. All right, there it is. Now it's transcribing this whole thing here. And oh. in about a minute, it's, I can then, you can see it'll be ready, right? Yeah. Meanwhile, I finish my blog post. And I'll include this video, including two videos. Your repurposed one from 2021 and the yeah. one that, I, that we made together called Uzair. And then we will take highlights out of it and turn them into Facebook ads and LinkedIn posts and all that. And I'll show you that. And I bet you nobody has ever seen before. Did I not spell this correctly? Where's the one that we downloaded on uh, MP4? I think there's a space, yeah. I saved this one out of Discord. Maybe is it still downloading? No, it can't be. Let's see. It's, yeah. Let's come over here. I hit the video export and we named it Uzair. Let's go look again. See, this is Dennis not being able to figure out where he kept his files. You got to name all these things correctly. Correctly, yeah. So I must not have downloaded it, correct? Did I not press enter? I don't see the use there. No. Let's do it one more time. It's a short video. Okay, so there yeah. it is. Okay. Oh, no, I'm in the wrong file now. I'm in my game. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're in a different one. Sorry. I'm in the wrong file. I think I closed it already. Hmm. But anyway, I would embed that video on the blog.
as easily as typing words, as typing. Yeah, as easily as typing. Okay. So then on this post, you can see that I'm, I'm using rank math. So I can, you know, obviously look for the keywords that I want to go after. Yeah. So let's say I want to go after, who's there? I want to rank on your name. Yeah. Okay. Okay. W-A-L-A. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Ooh, 48. Not bad. I need to get it up to like 80 plus because I put your name in the headline, which is good. Yeah. And then of course, in the post itself, for those of you guys that know WordPress, I have to choose a category. So yes, I'm going to put you in the awesome people category. And I think I have a PPC category or Google ads category. And I put, I, if you, you guys should always use WordPress. It, yeah. It's just automatically good for SEO. When I make when I add a tag that creates another page there. So the more times I use this tag, the better I'm going to rank on this, as you guys know. Yeah. And, but I messed up <laughs> even file. So you'll have to go search on his name for it. If, if we did things right, searching on Uzair. Kara Walla. Yeah. W A L A. Yeah. Will reveal this post. Okay. Now I publish it. Have you seen anybody publish this? It's no, not no. it's not six hundred words, is it? But no. Or whatever it is, but it's probably enough. Wow. So now I made this blog post, but no one's gonna see this blog post unless it gets shared and whatever, right? Yes. So then I'm gonna go to Twitter. And I will make a post here and say, making one video a day for four years helps who's it. Um, how do I write this? Or you can make it my SF digital because that's the Twitter f uh, handle we use at SF digital. Yeah. The result of making one video a day for four years, dominating first page Google. of Google for, what was it? Learning Google ads. Learn, learn Google ads. Learn Google Google ads. Dennis, this is fascinating. Yeah. Now I can include my blog post about this, right? Mm -hmm. I made a tweet and I can do the same thing on Facebook and Twitter and LinkedIn like, and all this. Uh, That's LinkedIn a nice tweet, that. right? Yeah. Right. So this tweet is now a few seconds old, right? Yeah. I but, but you know, you know the dollar day strategy, right? Yeah. Yeah. Then so then dollar day, so dollar day here, I would come in and run ads against this. You ever seen anyone create dollar day ads live? No. Oh, here it is. I'm going to show you how you do everything live, make the video live, write the blog post. So here's the engagement. I'm going to call it Uzair. And how much do I spend? Uzair, how much do I spend? One, one, one dollar a day. One dollar a day. And yeah. so we'd like to go for one week to give it enough yeah. time to learn a little bit. And you don't need targeting or any of this other fancy kind of stuff because why wouldn't you need targeting because algorithm will know what we are looking for yeah the algorithm is just super smart wow who do you think should see this maybe the people that do ppc yeah or google ads so who are who are the people that you really f like in google ads yeah gossip solutions eight yeah. i think that's his name company Maybe it's Sol 8. Sol 8, yeah, might be. 
No. Well, anyway, so we have right. yeah, we've got, got them. We have you in yeah. here. We can add yeah. other people. Yeah, so like digital marketing all followers, somebody like them. Yeah, yeah, we're targeting all the followers of these people. Oops, let me go back. I forgot to select the the creatives, and now I need to look at the tweets that we've made, so I can promote an organic tweets. Now I'm boosting a post, right? Mm -hmm. I'm boosting this tweet. And now I'm done. So I'm spending a dollar a day boosting this one tweet. Of course, I could add multiple tweets and I'm targeting yeah, yeah. people who follow you or Qasim, right? Yeah, there it is. Yeah. And now this campaign is live or will be live as soon as it gets approved, right? Approved, yeah. So there it is, right? How long, how much effort did that take? How long did that take? Well, well, from start to finish less than 20 minutes. Well, how long did it take me to boost the tweet? Oh, two minutes, not even that. Okay, so now already 19 people have seen this tweet. Yeah. And four people have engaged on it. That's pretty cool, right? Yeah. Now, how yeah. long do you think it should take to make a 15 second or one minute video, turn it into a blog post, push it on multiple channels, mm. right? Post it on multiple channels and then running ads against it. How long should that typically take? No more than an hour. Right, but how long do people spend messing around doing this kind of stuff right i know because this is why they don't do it they think it's too tedious complicated and they make things very complicated i mean this is just incredible what you just shown today so let me show you one other piece here and this should tie it together for everybody because they digital marketing especially you know the people most guilty of it are people that do digital marketing for a living because they make it way too complicated. True. But True. do you see what we did was we made the content and maybe we edited it a little bit. We distributed it, meaning we're putting it out there on multiple, you know, Twitter and yeah. Facebook and YouTube and TikTok. And then we amplified it by putting ads against it. Yeah. Could be Google ads, yeah. could be Facebook ads, could be Twitter ads, yeah. whatever it is, dollar a day, right? Or $10 a day or whatever it is. Yeah. Conversion objective, engagement objective, but you see how you go through these four steps. So now, you know, we, as long as you're making the content or someone else is making the content, making these short videos, I really like it when we can coach our best customers and partners and whatever to make the video. Yeah. You can edit it through many, many tools. Like you mentioned Canva or Descript or whatnot. Yeah. Then yeah. we have to post it, yeah. right? Which is distributing it. So we can post it on a blog, post it on Twitter, post it on Facebook. Yeah. And the last part is we have to amplify it yeah. so people see it, right? These so four things. Sorry, sorry to interrupt. Do you also run dollar a day on YouTube as well? Yeah, you can do the same, same thing applies on YouTube. Mm. Why not? Right? Yeah, because yeah. I could target, like you guys know on YouTube, I can target anyone who watched for a particular video. Yeah. So let's just say, you know, I'm on YouTube and let's say I want to rank on Google ads, right? Yeah. Cause maybe yeah. I'm an agency or learn Google ads. You said, yeah. right? That was the one. Okay. And let's say that this guy here has the, you know, people that are coming here and they're watching this guy yeah, or they're watching this guy. Okay. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah. yeah. Or, or this person, yeah, I can run ads in front of these videos cause I can use this as targeting. Right. I can, I could target the channel. I can right. target the keywords. Yeah. I can do retargeting. Like you understand with Google ads, right? Obviously you yeah. teach Google ads. So I don't need to tell you this, yeah. but for those of you guys, I can run dollar a day against this. Yeah. Placement targeting, keyword targeting, channel targeting, it's the same thing. Same Just thing. like I showed you on Twitter, it's the same thing. That's right. Brilliant. Yeah. No, it's amazing. Absolutely mind blowing stuff you've just gone through. And I, I and this is what I love about you. You keep things so simple. I know I was speaking to um, Cletus Coffee and yeah. he met you in San Diego and he said, Oh, on the on the street, he Dennis showed us how to do <laughs> and upload a video, make a video and upload it. And in like five minutes, it was all done and dusted. So it's, yeah. yeah, it's just mind blowing stuff. So thank you so much for your time and for sharing all this. I uh, absolutely loved it. And I know everybody else will um, love this as well. And those of you who haven't started video marketing, you've got to get started because if you're not doing this, your competitors will get started and you'll be left behind. So Dennis, I truly appreciate your time. Thank you so much. And I would like to invite once more 
uh, some other time as well to share some more knowledge and expertise. Happy to. Yeah. Thank you, Azair. So, Dennis, how can someone reach out to you or and where? Use whatever channel you like. Catch okay. me on Google, LinkedIn, LinkedIn, Twitter, Facebook. If it's for business, you can hire me. Or maybe you have a particular question, you want to join our coaching program. I'm Dennis at Blitzmetrics.com. Perfect. I'm going to put your details under this video as well. Thank you, my friend. Thank and you, Zair. I truly appreciate this. And thanks to everyone Honor. for watching this. I hope you enjoyed it. Bye for now. Cool. Brilliant. Thank you so yeah. much. And then share it, right? Cut, cut out clips of this. Write a blog post about what you learned. Oh, yeah. So then you're writing a blog post about writing a blog post about writing a blog post about making video. Yeah, perfect. Now, thank you so much. I'll Once it's uploaded, I'll, I'll link you to it. And imagine if, you know, a lot of you, you know, a lot of folks don't have the VAs or whatever. So you could hire people on Fiverr or Upwork to do all this stuff. Yeah. Or someone from, from the Philippines for $500 a month full time. And all they do is they edit your content and follow these processes. Yeah, brilliant. Thank you. Thanks, Dennis. Yeah, thank you. All right.